Uh, welcome to Alien Theorist Theorizing. Uh, we got a special interview episode again this week. I'm Braden. I'm Zell. I'm Dan. And I'm Andrew. And this time we've got senior SETI astronomer superstar Seth Shostak, author, uh, astronomer extraordinaire, and we're super excited to have him here uh this <laughs> this case file i suppose i'm gushing like i'm i'm freaking out because i'm super excited to have you uh here dan talks set. about you all the time <laughs> yeah that's it dan needs yeah. help yeah, yeah. <laughs> that's been brought up he does he's actually, got yeah. a green screen behind him to cover up all your pictures behind it's, <laughs> yeah it's just all it's all uh show stack memorabilia back there yeah yeah um <laughs> Yeah, um, I, I remember uh, reading your book a couple of years ago, the Confessions of a Alien Hunter um, book, and uh, just a great, great read all around. Just kind of getting, I think it's wonderful, it's like looking into radio astronomy and these things, and it's kind of just right up our alley, uh, looking up these things, and we're just like, I'm super excited. <laughs> I'm pumped. <laughs> yeah. Now, Seth, for people who are not familiar with you, I mean, this is this is not your this has not been your lifelong job like you've had many jobs in the past so how did you get into SETI and uh, searching for signs of other intelligent extraterrestrial life well you're right uh, about my checkered past I've had many different jobs in many different fields actually um, that's because I can't quite decide on what it is that uh, I find interesting but as far as SETI goes you know I yeah I was interested in aliens I mean even as a grad student, I was using antennas that could be used to pick up <laughs> alien broadcasts. So that, you know, that was already, uh, that already led to an interest. But as far as uh, more, yeah, as far as more recent events go, I, I guess I got in, interested in this when I moved to California. That was in 1988, after living in Europe for a while. That's a good year. And, uh, mm -hmm. That's a good year, 1988. Was it? Are you referring to you know Vino or just being a good year because you were born that year? Or? Yeah, we were born that year. Or two <laughs> of us him. were. <laughs> Got him. <laughs> well, uh, eighty-eight. Yeah, yeah, it was an okay year. Anyhow, I moved here. <laughs> the SETI Institute found uh, found out that I was living in the area. SETI Institute. Well, it wasn't even the SETI Institute. Well, I guess it was at that point. But they were only about two miles away from where I'm living, and uh, they asked me if I wanted a job. So that's Ooh, how that you, happened. They, they didn't name it after you? I thought it was Sethi. Isn't that what it is? <laughs> yeah. Well, it's, al it? it's almost my name. Not quite. Oh, okay. <laughs> All right. 